Hey guys, welcome back to the second devlog for my mobile space game. I just wanted to start this video off with a thanks. I read every single one of your guys' comments and you guys have gave me a lot of feedback on the last video and I'm going to be incorporating a lot of those ideas into the future devlogs as well as this one. So I just want to say thanks to you guys. Also, if you have any other ideas, you can leave a comment down below. I wish I was able to get more done on Monday. I was pretty busy and I had quite a bit of schoolwork, so I wasn't able to get much done at all. By much done, I mean nothing done, so. <laughs> Today I implemented the toaster boss. It was inspired by the pixel art I created that day also. I had a couple of issues with the toaster boss that I implemented. They had a rough implementation. Also, I added support for other enemies to have like movement patterns and move back and forth. I got this idea from a comment that was suggested to my last devlog. Today I fixed some of the toaster's issues. I also made it so it moves back and forth just like the enemies. I fixed hitbox issues on the enemy's movement. They weren't actually, the hitbox wasn't following along. So now that it's been fixed. I also added some more sound effects for the coins to just make it less annoying. So that I think I have like three sound effects right now. I also fixed the issue where if the player hit one of the toaster boss's bullets, well after the game has finished, then it would restart the game, but now I fixed it so all the bullets get destroyed when the next level UI turns on. I also made it so that the toaster bullets have health. I also set up a reload speed power up that speeds up the reload speed. I currently do not have an implementation for it in the game. It just kind of exists right now, it's not actually fully into the game. Today I made it so new types of enemies are slowly introduced in higher levels. Every three levels of the game it introduces a new enemy. To make the game, it also makes the game more challenging and interesting. Right now I only have four enemies in the game but I plan on adding a lot more in the future. I also fixed the bug that was allowing the player damage upgrade to upgrade the drone's damage. I'm planning on having a separate upgrade that upgrades the drone damage, but I don't have that in the game yet. Today I added functionality for enemies to shoot towards the player. I also added sounds that play a different pitch to make the game less annoying. I had this in the old sound system, but I forgot to implement it into the new one, so now it is fully implemented. So that concludes today's devlog. I hope you guys liked it. If you liked it, leave a like and subscribe to this channel. It really helps me out a lot. I really appreciate every single one of your guys' feedback and everything you guys do. You guys are awesome, and I'll see you in the next one.